Yes, welcome to our channel GPSTR HSTR TET guide. Today we are going to discuss some of the important questions, 15 most important questions on psychology. Now without wasting time, let's go to first question. The first question, who is the father of psychology? The options are Wilhelm Mund, J.B. Watson, Sigmund Freud and Jean Piaget and the correct answer to this question is Wilhelm Wundt yes now we are going to discuss just a little bit information about Wilhelm Wundt Wilhelm Wundt propounded the structuralism which is a one of the school of psychology right structuralism and also Wilhelm Wundt built the first psychological independent lab in 1879 when well, in 1879 at Leipzig Germany Leipzig Germany yes he built the first psychological independent lab in 1879 at Leipzig Germany now let's go to second question who is the father of experimental psychology in first question we know who is the, the father of psychology is Wilhelm Wundt. Now the father of experimental psychology, the options are B.F. Skinner, Tichner, Wilhelm Wundt and J.B. Watson. The correct answer to this question is also Wilhelm Wundt. Yes, Wilhelm Wundt is the father of psychology and also the father of experimental psychology. Now the third question is who is the mother of psychology we know the father of psychology is Wilhelm Wundt now the mother of psychology the options are Margaret Floyd Washburn Witten Calkins Renzuli and Ebbinghaus now let's delete Renzuli and Ebbinghaus among these two options the Margaret Washburn and Witten Calkins the mother of psychology is yes option one Margaret Floyd Washburn she is the mother of psychology and also some interesting uh, facts about her is she is the pupil of Tichner, E.B. Tichner. I think you might have heard about her, E.B. Tichner and she had written a book, Washburn written a book named The Animal Mind, The Animal Mind. Yes, she had written the book, The Animal Mind, The Animal Mind, yes, and also she is the first woman to complete PhD in psychology. Yes, she is the first woman to complete PhD in psychology. Now let's go to the next question, the fourth question. Who is the father of Indian psychology? We know the father of psychology is Wilhelm Wundt. The mother of psychology is Margaret Fly Washburn. Now, the father of Indian psychology. The options are Kishore Phadke, Narendranath Sen Gupta, Amit Abraham. And next is Gunamudian David Bose. And the correct answer to this question is the father of Indian psychology is Narendranath Sen Gupta. The interesting thing is in 1916. In 1916, Narendra Nath Sen Gupta built the first psychological laboratory in India at Kolkata. Where? At Kolkata, Narendra Nath Sen Gupta built the first psychological laboratory in 1916. And the next question is, fifth question, who is the father of child psychology? The father of psychology is Wilhelm Wundt, mother of psychology is Margaret Floy Washburn and the father of Indian psychology is Narendra Nath Sen Gupta and now the father of child psychology, child psychology, I think you might have known the answer. Now the options are Neisser, William James, Friedrich Frobel and Jean Piaget. Yes, the correct answer is Jean Piaget and Jean Piaget is the father of child psychology. He called children as little scientists. Yes, 
which is very important little scientist and the active builders and active constructors he called child as little scientist active builder and active constructors and also his famous theory is intellectual development theory or cognitive theory which is intellectual development theory or cognitive theory which has four stages i think you might have know about this that is sensory motor period pre-operational concrete operational and formal operation right yes now let's go to next question the sixth question who is the father of social psychology social psychology father of social psychology the options are thorndike neisser kurt levin and Werthmann. the correct answer is kurt levin kurt levin is called as the father of social the father of social psychology or socialism socialism yes now let's go to the next question the seventh question who is the father of cognitive psychology cognitive psychology the father of child psychology is Jean Piaget the father of cognitive psychology the options are Thorndike, Neisser, Kurt Levin and Werthmann the correct answer to this question is the father of cognitive psychology is Neisser Neisser is called the father of cognitive psychology the next question is who is the father of behaviorism yes which is very very important question father of behaviorism the options are jb watson thorndike abraham maslow and wilhelm wundt we know that wilhelm wundt is the father of psychology right yes so the father of behaviorism is jb watson yes one of the interesting or famous saying of jb watson is give me one dozen one one dozen kids i can make them anything that is give me one dozen kids i can make them anything it is a famous saying of jb watson let's go to next question ninth question who is the father of educational psychology educational psychology right educational psychology the options are wilhelm Mund, jean piaget Thorndike, Francis Galton. The correct question to this, sorry, the correct answer to this question is Thorndike. Yes, who is the father of educational psychology means? The Thorndike is called the father of educational psychology. And he also given the trial and the error method. Trial and error method. Yes, which is also very important let's go to the next question the tenth question who is the father of kindergarten kindergarten the options are Friedrich Froebel, Sigmund Freud, Jean Piaget, William James you might confuse between kindergarten so it may be belongs to the child so it might be Jean Piaget no that is completely wrong answer the father of kindergarten is Friedrich Froebel Friedrich Froebel is called the father of kindergarten. He called or he compared child to child to a plant. Yes, who compare child to a plant means Friedrich Froebel. And also he built first kindergarten school in Germany. Where? In Germany he built first kindergarten schools school yes now let's move to next question the 11th question who is the father of american psychology which is also very important the father of american psychology and the options are sigmund freud william james abraham maslow and jb watson the correct answer to this question is the father of american psychology is william james yes William James is called the father of American psychology and he is also propounded the functionalism which is also a school of psychology which is also a school of psychology and also he wrote a book <coughs> sorry 
he wrote a book called principles of psychology principles of psychology he wrote a book its name principles of psychology now <coughs> let's go to the next question the 12th question who is the father of psychoanalysis psychoanalysis who is the father of psychoanalysis the options are sigmund freud william james abraham maslow and j p watson who is the father the father of psychoanalysis is sigmund freud sigmund freud is the father of psychoanalysis we have to learn more things about sigmund freud is very famous in psychology actually and also he had given the three stages of mind three stages of mind which is id ego and super ego yes we come across some certain questions like who given the id concept or id ego super ego concept which is sigmund freud and also he had given the concept of oedipus and electro complex oedipus and electro complex in oedipus a son show more love towards mother in electro the daughter show more love towards the father yes which is given by sigmund freud right sigmund freud is given that and also he has given the ego defense mechanism which is the ego defense mechanism ego defense mechanism right and he had also written a famous book called interpretation of dreams what is the name of that book interpretation of interpretation of dreams which is very very important we come across certain questions like who wrote the interpretation of dreams book which is sigmund freud we have to learn more about sigmund freud for any examination now let's move to the next question the 13th question who is the father of gestalt psychology gestalt psychology or gestaltism who is the father of gestalt psychology the options are abraham maslow wertmeier francis galton and kurt lewin the correct answer is wertmeier wertmeier is called as the father of gestaltism let's move to next question the 14th question who is the father of humanism humanism the options are thorndike washburn abraham maslow and jb watson the correct option to this question is the father of humanism is abraham maslow abraham maslow is called the father of humanism and he had given the hierarchy of needs hierarchy of needs which has five stages right physiological safety love and self love or belongings esteem and self actualization these are the five stages of hierarchy of needs which is given by abraham maslow let's move to the last question that is the father of eugenics only few of the students know the answer the father of eugenics who is the father of eugenics the options are jean piaget francis galton abraham maslow and jb watson the answer to this question is the father of eugenics is the francis galton yes francis galton is called the father of eugenics and also he is the first person to work on intelligence intelligence the first person to work on intelligence that is francis galton yes this is the end of this session now please do like share and subscribe to our channel so that i can make more and more detailed videos on psychology thank you one and all